Hi, um, today I'm going to talk about role-level security in Tableau. So after you apply this uh, method, um, after you publish the dashboard to the Tableau server, your user can only see the data that is belong to his or her own, uh, let's say, department or sector. So now I'm going to show you how to uh, uh, create a filter. So let's say you have. Um, so let's say you want to control your dashboard based on uh, the department uh, uh, under department level uh, by user. So let's say uh, this is uh, a department uh, restriction. Okay. So now you need a function to. Um, um, to uh, to get to get the uh, username for the login for the person uh, for in for whoever is viewing the dashboard so let's say uh, so if username equal to someone let's say for myself Alan then uh, I th I'll just use the, the the dimension within this uh, sample store data so let's say uh, region equal to central okay so what this function here and then add okay so what this function is doing is after you publish the dashboard and apply this uh, filter in the, in the in the dashboard in, the, in, in this dashboard um, whenever for example myself log into a Tableau server this filter would check if the username if, if the person who log in is uh, let's say Alan myself if it is if this um, condition is correct then the dashboard the entire dashboard will only show the data where the region is only for central so uh, for example after I, I log into the dashboard I can only see central um, the data from central but even if there are some other uh, uh, category in this uh, region uh, dimension I won't be able to filter or nor can I uh, actually see those data so only so only data on the rows only with region equal to central are uh, available to this person to this user okay so let's say if you if there are some additional um, um, criteria you you want you only want this user to view and let's say I think there's a category equal to you can say anything like category A. Let's say if you want uh, to uh, allow this user to view two categories, so category equal to B. Okay. And here you need a parenthesis to include all these. So that means if the user, the, the people um, who log in uh, is this person, then this person can only see data that is either for a uh, region uh, equal to central or category equal to a and b so after um, um, so basically you can apply uh, multiple uh, condition in this uh, restriction uh, calculation but make sure uh, um, if you if you want to apply restriction within one uh, dimension then use the or uh, um, statement for different dimension then use the and uh, function um, and statement to connect different dimension and so this is only for one um, user so let's say there's another user let's say equal to Alan number two then region equal to West or region equal East use a uh, parenthesis um, to put them together and for category equal let's say C okay 
So now, uh, they so this uh fun this filter will uh is will apply on two two different individuals. So something um just to make it um um more secure. Um, since this is related to um, data security, so always make sure uh, you apply um, um, upper function here, so that so this fun this will capture the the login for the for the current user, and this will make sure you are comparing uh, upper cases on both uh, both sides. So uh, this is just to make sure it is comparing the same thing. Otherwise, sometimes if this is lowercase compared to uppercase, it might be not a, a, a perfect, it might be not an exact match. So this just to make it uh, more uh, formal. So you, so this is how you can uh, create a calculation to uh, restrict the user to view only their own data. So after you create this uh, calculation, go back to the data source and do the add filter here. And then you can input um, uh, the, uh, the, the calculation you just created. Always select true and then hit OK. So this filter will, well, uh, there's no data here because um, I, I create a fake username. But um, uh, after you apply this, so uh, if, you, if you are familiar with the, um, the filter uh, order in Tableau, uh, you, you will notice that um, the, the source uh, filter will always apply in the first, uh, in the first order. So, so that's uh, that's why I uh, I uh, in, uh, include the filter in uh, over here. So that means whenever you open a dashboard or uh, or you publish, whenever uh, whenever a dashboard is open, uh, this filter will always apply the first. So so that means when you when a user log in, it will always check whether uh, the username for this um, for this user. Uh, and then applying the filter based on what you created over here, so that uh, if if the username it is included, then um, then uh, that user can only see his or her own data. Otherwise, it will you will see nothing like a no value or a completely empty dashboard. Okay. So another thing I want to talk about here is the URL action here. So sometimes we send a URL to um, different people. So, um, but uh, let's say I'll just say Tableau.com, or, or that's the uh, URL for your own um, for your uh, for a Tableau um, for a Tableau dashboard. So, okay. So let's say you want to when you send out the link, you want that user to see what you already predefined. So here, you can say that um, region. Uh, there's no uh, just to make sure that there's no space in between since this is a URL, not a not a not a calculation. So URL equal to central. It has to be uh, the 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 what whatever is uh, the the exact naming or the exact typing in your in your data. So it has to be like for example capital C here. So let's say. For in in the calculation we just created, uh, we let's say we we want to uh, uh, after send out this URL, we want the user to see predefined a filter for uh, Central and West. So so after they open the dashboard of by from the URL you send it to them, uh, they will only see Central and West region that is clicked uh, a check uh, under that uh, in in that specific dashboard. Let's say you want to apply another filter. Use the M percent here, and let's say region equal to or a category. Okay, so category. Uh, this is also a capital R. 
you have to use the exact naming in, in your data set. Uh, category equal to, okay, let's say office supply. Okay. So now all, there's a space between office supply. So to take care of that in a URL, you need to type in the percentage office supplies. I guess that is uh, supplies. Okay, so you need to type in the percentage to take this uh, as a character to, to um, for the space here. So okay, so after you put a, a question mark and these um, filters in the URL, and then you send out the URL to someone else who have access to the uh, to the uh, Tableau server. When they click on that um, URL, they will see their dashboard pre-filtered uh, by region equal to central and west. So you, if you see if you click under that region in, filter in your dashboard, you will see that these two will, will be checked and the category of office supply checked. So um, the difference between this URL action and, uh, and this um, username filter we just created earlier is that uh, in that method, um, the user will not, will not be uh, able to view uh, data that is, within, that is not uh, uh, in his or her own uh, department or, uh, or those we didn't uh, type in. So let's say for 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 that uh, filter that uh, in that is predefined as central region, that user will is will not uh, will not see uh, the data that is in the west in, in in his own dashboard. However, when you uh, when you send out uh, the URL in this way, uh, you, the 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 dashboard is only pre-filtered by these two regions, but but the user is always uh, able to uncheck these two and to check uh, other filters that is not with uh, in his or her own department. So, uh, well, if you're still um, not, um, uh, if, I would say the best way is to, uh, to, to, to test a few cases to make sure you understand the filter, the, uh, the restriction, the user restriction filter in the source filter and for this uh, URL action. So uh, try a few cases and then um, and then apply this uh, restriction in your uh, dashboard. So thank you very much and let me know if you have any questions.